Hello, this is Gary Schnitke, and this is a five-minute farm doc daily dealing with fall and ammonia applications and profitability on farms enrolled in PCM. PCM, or Precision Conservation Management, is a conservation and record production record keeping service run by Illinois Corn and Illinois Soybean Association. There are approximately 100,000 acres enrolled in 16 counties in East Central Illinois that we're going to summarize their fall application practices on. About 36% of the farms make fall applications in, the, in that data set. If we look at what they did in 2021 and the total N applied, 149 pounds of that came from the fall and ammonia application. And that's the amount coming from anhydrous ammonia put on in fall. 19 additional pounds came from DAP and MAP applications generally made in the fall. We had 23 pounds of N also come from a spring herbicide application, which included a nitrogen solution in it. We had one pound at plantings. A very small number of farmers put nitrogen on at planting. And there were 25 pounds of N that were put on post-plant. And that was either in the form of anhydrosome onia, 28 or 32% after planting. About 60% of the farms made an application after planting, which means 40% did not. There were 217 pounds of actual N put on, and there was a large amount of variability in N, actual N put on by these farms. 18% put on between 180 and 200 pounds of actual N on across all years in the study. 7% had less at 160 and, and 180 pounds, and then we had uh, many farms put on nitrogen rates above that. 200 and 220 pounds, for example, was at 34% of the fields. If we look at the profitability and average that across all years, to 2016 to 2021, the highest profitability was in that 180 to 200 pound range, and they had a profitability of $336 per acre. That varied across years, but $336 per acre. That 180 to 200 pounds of N is where university recommendations generally fall. Those, at those rates, we would expect the profitability to be the highest, and that is what turned out to be the case. University recommend, recommendation, on average, maximize returns to nitrogen. If we're looking at 2023, um, there is a higher concern from over applying nitrogen because anhydrous ammonia prices are high, $1,400. And if we take that as a ratio of corn price, we come up with 233. That 233 is much higher than it has been in previous years, suggesting that, that it is more important this year to get our 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 nitrogen rates at the proper level, and those would in general be lower than they have been in the past. You can read more about this issue in the Farm Doc Daily, link to in the video description.